Hello guys, this is Warrior here, and we are back with another Northern Dunedain Let's Play episode in version 5, <clears throat> using the Reunited Kingdom path, as we've chosen. So, um, not nearly as keen on fighting this battle. I have cavalry, so I do have combined arms, which would allow me to rout a lot of this. They only have one archer, so I could potentially skirmish them into oblivion. Uh, yes, with the right micromanaging, so I'm going to hold off on that just yet. These troops are pushing east. Um, you go there. Latash is fortifying. And there's a steady stream of troops and a pretty decent garrison at Mount Graham. Okay. Well, once I get all of these troops re recruited, um, that should shift the balance of power firmly into my favor which I am getting a, a lot of troops starting to uh, be able to recruit them so that is good um, yes you're getting the yeah the auxiliary barracks and then you need a ballista maker Stewart's Hall will allow me to get the royal barracks if I remember correctly alright now <clears throat> to the south yeah, you hold there, and you just kind of just loiter there. Um, can I move any troops? Oh, yes, I was in the process of getting all of these troops, and I think I was waiting one more turn to get a full kind of stack of troops headed that way, if I remember correctly. Yeah, that's what I was doing. I remember now. What are you doing? Oh, you're already on low taxes. Then put that in. And a royal barracks would be definitely wanted. Uh, but I don't... I think you can just get uh, Citadel Guard. Huh. Sorry about that. The lighting is doing something weird. That's interesting. Put that in. Alright. They're still besieging that, which I think they will attack here soon. Um, you're kind of stuck there. You're waiting to come across. So are you. We'll have a wave of reinforcements to the south. We're gathering troops to bring up here. You're stuck. You have great beasts, which concerns me a lot, actually. Uh, more than what I would even care to admit. So we need to stack some of these marines together and build together a a force <clears throat> that can handle them need lots of marines with javelins catapult that spear unit yes my lord by your command your orders my lord that archer unit as you wish my lord merging army um, ooh, that... Oh, and no, I just sent them over there. Dang it. Let's get to 50. Okay. Alright. Um, the rest of y'all can stay there. Yes, my lord. <clears throat> okay, um... Okay. Your orders, my lord. My lord. I can't see. Yes, my lord. And I... I build another watchtower. You pull back, see if they'll be baited into attacking the settlement, and if they do, then we can pounce, and I think that would be a wiser strategy than what I had before. <clears throat> Alright, now, this. Yes, my lord. We shall engage. Alright, so they have no archers other than one longbow. We have one, two... One, two, three, four archers. We can skirmish them down. We have one, two, three, five units of cavalry. Mm, my infantry line will be pretty, pretty lackluster. Let's don't risk it. Let's wait because if I wait one turn, I'll get two more of these guys, and that will probably be enough. To see them off. Your orders, my lord. Yeah, because they can't reach. None of them can reach. 
And once I get all these recruited, we'll be fine. And then I'll have another wave of troops coming over. Um, oh, I need to get all of y'all on the march. Yeah, all of y'all on the march. Over. Bactria, you are a little ways off. So are you. Might as well wait one turn and get that extra spear. Yes, my lord. And then ship you off. Um, you come south. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these two units, stick them there, and that might make them decide to veer off and attack them. And if it does, they can just pull back. And then I can re, uh, reinforce. Yeah, once I get these troops recruited, th th this is this is not a problem. Because these three provinces will easily be able to mount a counterattack and then push while the north handles the remnants of Angmar. So, uh, is there anything I'm missing before I intern? This is going to be an issue. Yeah, you keep holding there. You're building that. Uh, you are... Uh, actually, hold up. Stop that. Um, retrain you. And okay, yeah, retrain all that. That's fine. Your will, my lord. Oh yeah, I'm waiting for you to get across so I can dump you here, and then you will uh, probably go here. So I want to win here. If I can push this back, then I can use those troops to uh, to pincer Edis Thea, and then I'll use the reinforcing forces from Dol Amroth and. Uh, Mithrice, one to go here and reinforce this, and then any reinforcements that I get from here will be deviated to the south to Umbar, which it'll be these two forces here, which should give me enough to break the deadlock, hopefully. Right, you're stuck there. Uh, is that an extra? Yeah, that is an extra unit. You two go there. This concerns me, <clears throat> mostly because I have nothing to fight the Great Beast, if I remember correctly, that's in this force. Yeah, they got two of them. Like, what the... What? This is ridiculous. But okay, alright. Fair enough. I'm about to drown you in bodies. Let's we'll come up with different ways to kill them. All right, uh, let's uh, intern. Ah, right, Rohan, you're you're moving up. Okay, okay, okay. I see you. But then you're moving those two forces that away. That that makes no sense. Okay. You know, we, we do something good, and then do we we do something equally as stupid? R Rohan is your biggest enemy. No one else is. So like, I don't understand the confusion here, but okay. Fair enough. You do you. You do you, Rohan. You do you. The landings, what are you about to do? You decide not to. Fair enough. So you're going to, to attack me. Fair enough. Let's withdraw. Fall back and retreat. It's not Taking the worst thing. Yeah, I didn't think they were going <laughs> to... All right, Harad's reinforcing. Are they going to try and... Oh, come on, come on, attack me. I know you want to do it. Oh, that was foolish. Extremely foolish. Extremely foolish. Go, whoa. One, two, three, four... Five, six generals. Uh, that's a lot. That's a lot. Your courage, Come on. Come on with your bad selves. You're going to learn today. You're going to learn today not to flock with me. I'm about to end this whole problem right here. I, was, I thought I was going to have to break the siege. I ain't going to have to break the siege. Not even close. This is going to be great. Uh, all right, night time? Really? Night time. That's when you chose to attack me. It's night time. 
Okay, so... Uh, is this going to be one of those battles again? I hope not. Alright, um... Yeah, fire's good. Ballista, you... Like... Well, just just start there, and I'll I'll move you as needed. Okay. Um, all right. Um, let's hate this wooden wall here. Why can't I? That's strange. Wouldn't let me put them on the wall. Alright. You can fit there. You can fit there. You can fit there. But the smaller archer group can't fit there. God. Alright. Alright. Um, you stay back. Actually, you get right, right there. You do not need to be on the walls. I don't know why you're on the walls. That makes absolutely no sense. Uh, you stay back. And you stay back as well. Um, you... Oh, you can't. Okay. Then put the X-Men up there. You'll counter out any advantage they get from that. Archers... Okay, you don't need to be that far out. And who's all the way over there? Another sp a spear and this sword unit. You'll be there. Uh, where's the sword unit at? It's this sword unit. Okay. You start right here, and you start, like, right here, because they're going to come around. Once they breach, they're going to come around, because they don't have siege engines. Do they? No, they do not. Okay, yeah, because they'd be up at the front. All right. Um, all right, let's start battle. You, you go there you get a little bit further to the left you push up a little All right, very egg. not worried about them you'll be fine why are you not trying to breach the walls Okay, shoot, shoot the Warlord Guard. You get off the walls. This is interesting. Okay, make sure you're ready for this. You are the elite forces of Gondor. You stop firing. Alright, <clears throat> now, so we don't have to deal with it as much later. Shoot the Varag Lances. You... Shoot the Variag Nobles. Shoot the Variag Lances. Are you almost to the walls? That you are. I'm not too concerned about it. Just just being 100% real here. Not too concerned. A cavalry force in a siege is uh, pretty much absolutely worthless. Um, I mean, it really is. Uh, the only thing that helps them is their mobility, which is completely negated when you're fighting in a city. So, yeah. You know. And we can just bottle them up. And I have a bunch of spearmen at the gate. So instead of attacking multiple different locations, they're trying to spread me out. So my anti-cav is not nearly as uh, potent. The AI has went with an alternative strategy. 
which is questionable to say the least. Alright. So as they start moving... Commence firing. This is not going to go well for you. Especially considering the sheer amount of spears I have down here. Yeah, that's, uh... That's not going to go over well. We've killed 16% of them. The 3% lost for us. There goes some arrows. You rotate over to there. You get to there. And the tower should start doing some work. Where is my other general? There you are. Yep. Just start shooting. Shoot the Wind Riders of Khan. They're the ones that are the biggest things to deal with. How are we doing? I would say wonderful. Not fantastic, but wonderful. <coughs> fantastic would be amazing. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be needing you at all. I think you're going to do more harm than good. Uh, definitely. Maybe when the second wave gets here. Maybe. Uh, Athelian Rangers. You. Move to here. You're no longer needed. And you... Move to there. Yes. What's left? Kill the very nobles, please. Is that their general? Yeah, that is their general. Oh, that's the only reason why he's alive. Is because of, uh... He's fighting, um, not Spearman. Swordsman. Kill him, please. We got two generals alive down here. This is very bad for morale. Like, terrible for morale. Well, there goes one. Oh, here comes the reinforcements. That's not going to end well for you. Oh, look. Bring in extras. No. They actually shot them. That's uh, surprising. I didn't think they would actually be able to do that, to be honest. Alright, uh, you shoot them. You're completely out of ammunition, Hank. Alright. Killed about 50%. They're actually doing a pretty decent job, to be honest. Uh, way better than what I thought they would be doing. That very noble is all but extinguished. Shoot them. Hello. This isn't going well for you. Perfect. Him, his troops will lose their will to fight. We actually killed the enemy general. And several family members. They may get regicided, not from this, but they may get regicided before we actually kill them. Considering how many people we've actually killed. There's another enemy general dead. To use them all in this one gamut tells me that they're really desperate for troops. Otherwise, they wouldn't be sending seven generals my way. Of course, in a field battle, they would have won this engagement. 
but in a siege, not so much. And I will say, Gondor is excellent in sieges. Because uh, they just have the heavy infantry and archers to match almost anybody. my you okay that's just annoying I gotta get away from that sound bug that's just that's just annoying right, pull back inside let them come on in yeah that looks like a very confident force it's about to die. Well, there goes another enemy general. Alright, meet them at the threshold. We'll fight them right about here. Alright, yes, you. You come around to there. Oh, I actually lost power. If we continue like this, we will smash the That doesn't make much sense. It makes very little sense actually. Alright, this is it. This is all they got. That's what I thought. Yeah, the Trevor Rochets haven't even fired a single shot, and I think they're gonna do more harm than good. And they would have in this entire mess Only of the battle. The enemy force remains. So Ain't much to do except for sit here and wait, get the popcorn out. All I know is I've been spewing forth some gas on some very dangerous levels right now. And I hope I don't have to visit the royal throne in a minute. Uh, but it's looking like... Ooh, then I'm probably going to have to. Hopefully you didn't hear that. bad when you smell it. It's bad. Yeah. Really, you get with the very eggs, you have to try and fight as many battles in the open field as you possibly can, and only only break that Behold how the enemy are utterly vanquished. Whenever um, you have uh, weakened forces. So yeah, I'm definitely about to have to go to the bathroom. I apologize for that. But it's coming. Ooh, like a freight train. Alright, let's get out of this so I can hit pause. Come on, game. Normally you load up super duper quick. Today you're just taking a little bit. That's okay. No. Yeah, yeah, you screwed up big time. You know it. Okay, go ahead. Attack, us, attack me again. That That's not going to go well for you, buddy. Not going to go well for all. And I'm about to take more territory. In the next few turns. The enemy lay siege to our people. Really? Ooh, hey, hey, what are you gonna do? That has me worried on what they're about to do. Yeah, you need to cut on over. We'll some territory guardsmen. By your command, we shall engage. That's probably enough now to beat him. Yeah, that's probably enough. But we'll wait just a second. Yes, my lord. You're okay. Oh. <laughs> they flock a flock away. They were like, nope. 
All right, that's fine. My lord. As you wish. We'll start gathering forces in large numbers, and we'll be able to do something about that. So get all of them recruiting. You fall. Go northward. You go south. What's the situation? Not terrible. Not great, but not terrible. That's a pretty decent place to be in. Well, to be honest, do I get Arthur Dean Footman from here? Yeah, there they are. All right, cool. I thought I did, but I couldn't remember if I did or not. I know I get him from here. Yeah, two more turns on them. Uh, they get ballistas. <clears throat> they allow you to break down siege engines. Okay. Um, I, I gotta sort out all these troops. To the ships. Ready. To the ships. The all right, what's here? You. You. By your command, your will, my lord. Rally up. As you wish. Go east. Fast. Your command. Marching to war. The day is ours to war then. Yeah, that's gonna be a complete another smash. You are I'm not sure what you're doing. But I don't like it. Ships ready. Alright, you pull back to there. I don't like it at all. Alright, um, I'm not entirely sure where they're going, and it's making me nervous, so let's see if we can uh, consolidate. You're hanging out up there. Did you leave... Did you leave it open? That might be my best chance to take it, actually. Can you reach? No, you cannot. As you wish. Move up to there. You move back to the fort. Ships ready. You stay hanging out there. All right. Your will, my lord. Orders, my lord. By your command. Load up in the ship. My lord. Your will, my wish I had a general so I could your pluck will, you because lord. you're a really good uh, offensive general. And you're ready to go. Ships so ready. you arrive here. A fine day to sail. My lord. Ships ready. What do you have? Ships you. Ready. Merge here. We got an AA Set problem sail. and we need it dealt with swiftly. Ships ready. You have a small contingent. Ships ready. So let's move you yes, sir. here. Sail. Get you to the docks. You rally up all of that. Eventually get that built, which will give me uh, everything I really need to recruit from there. Or ever would want to recruit from there. Um, you're recruiting. In large numbers, move across and to here. Plegra, you are recruiting. In large numbers, good. Uh, can you get... No, you cannot. That's only... I think it's only this here and on this side. It's on both sides that can get the Marines, which I'm going to need the Marines up north. So, yeah, that's uh, definitely a good thing. Um... <clears throat> My Lord. Yes. Right, we do have one unit of... Marines. Yes, my lord. Uh, hello. Your orders, my lord. Have a taste of my blade. I'm I'd rather support you. them. Yes. To battle. What does he have? Olag High, and that's it. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, we're about to fight that. Cause, what do you have? All cavalry, all the time. That's perfect. <clears throat> I have a heavy infantry force. 
Um, yeah, we'll get them and we'll get them in the end turn if they attack. So I'm not too concerned about that. Um, which had a very large reinforcement force coming. Alright. Um, oh, that's a pretty stout force. Hmm. Yes, my lord. How fortified is Mount Graham? Pretty damn fortified, but it would be an easier attack than Latash would be. So let's go across the river. Rally up, and we will attack Mount Graham in a pretty bloody siege. Yes, my lord. Now this situation. I think we can handle them. Let's see here. We attack. Famous last words, I know, but we'll see what we can do. We haven't faced the Khan yet, so that's interesting. Alright, so since we have a pretty large skirmisher force... And a very large kind of hold your line infantry force. Yeah. Oh, look at those territory guards. They just look like they can hold forever. I'm going to need them to hold forever. All right. Archer militia, you are going to be strewn out behind them. The rest of you, the archer battalions, you two are going to be together, and you two are going to be together. You three will be on the right flank, and you cavalry will be on the left, hidden from view. Yes. All right. You, I want you over there, causing havoc. All right. You two, where is the most dangerous? Most dangerous is the North Guard. Just shoot the North Guard. The rest of you, I don't care who you shoot. Just shoot them. So that's what's fine. They're holding their ground because they don't know where the cavalry is. And I think they want this archer duel to commence. You two run. You two run. Keep peppering them. Cavalry. Announce your presence. They're going defensive. I think mostly because of the, um, the cavalry on the flanks. Has got them a little nervous, as it were. Which, I mean, it didn't make me nervous, too. Two units of cavalry can completely ruin your day. If not careful. Move in there. Shoot them. They do have a general. Charge them down. You pull up here. Goblin infantry should be broken in running off the field. Run away. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Yeah, we've, we're exchanging well with them. That much is certain. Exchange well there. Keep moving. Shoot them. You go wide. Good. Keep pulling away those spears. <clears throat> How are we doing here? Wonderful. 
Get away. Right, pull away. You swing that away. You swing that away. How are we doing? Uh, not terrible. You two stop and shoot. You run. You shoot. Good system. Run. Alright, we're about to deal with that archer group. And then we'll come over here and deal with these Angmari infantry. The fact that I'm drawing away infantry formations away is what I'm trying to do here. I don't want to face them as a big conglomerate, as it were, of troops attacking me. I want it, uh, to face a small contingent from the actual force. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Yeah. Probably let that fight out. Yeah. How are we doing? Keep shooting the hillman. You stop and attack that flank. Alright. You attack. You attack. Tie, tie them down. You go tie them down. Who are you fighting? Pull away. Pull away. I just need you to tie them down for a minute. <clears throat> How are we doing here? Not great, but I don't need you to be great. I just need you to tie down those troops. Can you tie them down? Perfect. Alright. Pull further back up. You turn about. Charge them down. Only half the enemy force remains. Peel away. We've killed 54% of their total force. Which is actually fantastic. We'll deal with those spears, if possible. They're actually doing reasonably well. Shoot the cell swords. How are we doing here? We've reduced them enough to where they're not a threat. You come around. You're going to attack the North Guard straight on. And they're not a threat either. And they're so far away from the battlefield, they're not going to do anything. Shoot them. Keep shooting them. You're fine. <clears throat> You're fine as well. We're about to win there. They're bringing up the sail swords. Oh, you just got attacked by. That's not particularly good. They break in the middle. Yep, they broke in the middle. That's fine. They don't have the best best morale in the world. Uh. No, no, no. Yeah, they go against all that cavalry. Not very well, I would assume. Yeah, you are not... You're not fighting anybody, so shoot them. You, who are you fighting with? Fighting with somebody. Pill around. Come all the way over here and go after the snow orcs. Uh, that's fine. Them routing off the fields, okay. Where's my other. Did they get destroyed? I thought I had another cavalry unit, but apparently I do not. Alright. Get over here. Attack the halberds. 
Halpadir is in the rear. Yeah, you're slowly losing that. Okay. Crush them. Yep, yep, yep. You two, shoot the North Guard. Pin them down further. Alright. You two, pull over there so you have some shots. Actually, you already have some shots. Go to the North Guard. Just keep holding that, if possible. How'd that go? Not very good the battle is very for the Habadiers. Be they just broke. Rally over here. You come over here. You come completely over here. Those are pikes. Get away from the pikes. Tunidon Cav, you're doing awesome. Pull away. Keep watering the ground with them. You have arrived. Shoot them. Oh yeah, come on. This should send them packing. Halberdiers are anti-infantry forces. With a little bit of anti-cavalry, but mostly anti-infantry. That should see them expunged. And y'all are pretty stout troops. Y'all have done y'all's job. Nice annoying themed battle plate. The Rangers shoot the pikes now. They're gonna be a lot more useful shooting them. And we're about to deal with the uh, the North Guard anyways. <clears throat> Come on, get him. Okay, apparently we're not. That's apparently optional. Didn't know that. It's 34 of them remaining. Apparently I missed the memo where it's optional to actually shoot people. Uh, they've killed a lot of people, but it didn't really achieve much. Didn't really achieve much at all, actually, in the grand scheme of things. Oh, they don't. They're down to 11. Pull away. This will, in fact, cripple them, and once I combine my armies, I should be able to see off the remnants of Angmar. Knock, didn't need the battle. It's time to press the attack. Let's get him. He's all that remains, and I just want to kill that general. The more generals I kill, the less... They have to replenish their uh, ranks, as it were. And I might be able to catch them with a regicide. Which would be lovely. Is utterly... I would say that was a category of a heroic victory, considering they had way better troops than I did. <clears throat> and the fact that I was able to delay their advance for so long allowed me to achieve said victory. Mm, I'm probably going to go another 15 minutes. Well, yeah, about 15. Get warmed up. Um, execute. An honorable, glorious victory. Your orders, my lord. Orders. All right. Yes, my lord. My lord. Your will, my lord. Yes. Your orders, my lord. By your command. Yes, my lord. All right. Merge all that together. Okay. 
Just retrain them, retrain them. And then recruit whatever you can out of all of that. That'll be a lot simpler. In tow. You're not going to be able to do anything with that force. This force, maybe, but probably not. Yeah. So I have My Lord. My Lord. infantry coming. March to exhaustion. Continuing later. In relatively large numbers. Your orders, my lord. Yep, I'm gathering all this together. I wish I could use it in the north, because I could really, really use it. But uh looks like that's not gonna be for the not gonna be in the cards. But that's okay. Alright, you're gonna take over. Assembling a mighty host, my lord. I hope it is a mighty host. Ten turns, two turns for them. Okay. Two to nine barracks. That gives me recruitment of oh, the blade masters. It doesn't give me the base units, but that's okay. Yeah, because I can already recruit. Yeah, the yeah the raiders. I can already recruit them. So it just gives me extra infantry. All right, about to have a wave of troops here that need to come south. Yep. <clears throat> Down here. Already done all this? I have. Alright. We'll have this battle. Let's get him. So, this is by far the least dangerous of the two armies, by the way. The more dangerous one is the one with the Great Beast. Because anytime you gotta deal with Great Beast, it's annoying as all get out. But, yeah. I wanna deal with this, and hopefully Rohan will help me out and attack the other. So we shall see, though. All right. So you two, I want to keep you two back as much as possible. Because you're going to be what I use to deal with the trolls. All right. So my ally is an entirely cavalry base force. They're going to charge. Because it's their only hope of winning. But we're going to pull back to here so I can create a little bit better defense line. As it were, I got reinforcements coming up to this area. We're going to have these two as emergency reaction force to wherever the trolls come from. The cavalry is going to be in the rear. And then you'll strike out as needed. You two are going to go right there. All right. Let's see. What are they going to do? They're going to be defensive at first. Nope. They're being aggressive. They mostly just have chaff units. All right. So they're pushing forward. So let's push forward. Take over this high ground. Really didn't want them to engage me until... Okay, so they're going all the way up to that hill. Oh yeah, I should have some Arid Skirmishers and Riders of the Fold I can recruit. I need to check that out. Royal Guard. Yeah, this is an entirely cavalry-based force. <laughs> you add yourself to the left flank. I actually much prefer to be controlling the cavalry army in situations like this. And let the AI control everything else because I can joystick the cavalry a lot better than the AI can. But uh, it, it, it is what it is. <clears throat> Alright. Um, as soon as these guys get into position, it's whenever we will start making our moves, as it were. 
Oh, you do have one arid footman. One infantry unit. Well, that's good to know. Your power is your cavalry, but it is not in massed cavalry. Uh, b because you're terrible at using it. Absolutely terrible at use it, using it, but we shall see. Are they within range? Surprisingly, no. That's interesting. Alright, uh, just walk forward. Just a wee bit more. Get to where you are. Oh, right there. Oh, that was a good hit. Ooh, that was another good hit. Shoot the Alag High. Looks like we killed two of them. Yeah, I think we did. Because there's normally 12 of them. Don't be aggressive just yet. Come on, see if we can get lucky. Ooh, that almost hit. They're typically used to taking out clumped up infantry formations. Alright, be aggressive now. Not entirely sure what that's going to mean. Okay, so they are pivoting to my right flank. Right here. So move up. They're going straight for those territory guardsmen. Cease fire and start firing at them. You got one job. Kill them. Alright. You're going to flare out to the left. By the way, um, this is pretty much a maximum size army you can, you can field in one uh, force is with Mordor. And it's only Mordor that you can do this with. We're down to 10. Keep up the heavy fire. Oh, okay. Well, if you're going to do that... Trolls. Keep throwing javelins at them. That's our best hope of killing them. Yeah, you just routed. This whole unit just routed. If we continue like this, we will smash Not your smartest plan you ever had. Alright. Pull away. Archers, shoot at the rear lines as much as possible. Olag High, you're just doing Olag High things. There's not much... I mean, eventually we will kill them. They are re getting reduced out. Calvary getting into the mix will help somewhat. Uh, they'll somewhat help. <clears throat> well, that was a good hit. Um, shoot at the rear, 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 rear lines. Go, 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 go. Cavalry, swing around. All right, we've killed, we've lost ten percent to thirty-six percent. That's pretty good. Uh, not terrible. Attack them head on. Keep flaring, keep flaring, keep flaring out. Okay. Instead of shooting who you want, shoot who I'm telling you to shoot. That would be far more useful. We're down to five of them. You can actually shred um, Olak High and Great Beast with uh, Rohan. They have the perfect stuff to deal with it, which is the Arid Skirmishes. Very low cost way of dealing with them. Right, pull away. Thank you for pinning them down. Only half the enemy force remains. Uh, 
like extremely low cost way of dealing with them. Ooh, that killed way, way more of my own troops. You dealt with him? Yes. them you deal with that How are you doing you're doing well pull there we've already captured 300 of them they've been dealt with yes perfect Rohan might actually have the answer to dealing with great beast if I can get enough of those skirmishes out and get them into my armies they would provide the excellent counter to the great beast because I can just roll up and just shower them with javelins instead of having to rely on these guys the which are army the terrible they're just not down. great at dealing with them because they're infantry formations All right. this is a clear victory. infantry is just normally not very good against I can't go anywhere, really. But the good news is, is I actually get aired skirmishes from this location. Which is a big, big bonus. And I'd get Riders of the Fold, too. So I need to get that up, because I can get those recruited from this location. Which would be nice. Alright, I think I have them from here. So, you move out. Today, your will, my lord. All of these guys move Fight across. Your orders, my lord. Move up. Yes. Orders. I'm gonna stick you. It's a lot of trolls. Yes, my lord. My lord. We'll make your will, my lord. Get more we'll units coming. No uh, Riders of the Fold. Erid skirmishes again. Erling Axemen are not very good. Rittermark Axemen are actually pretty good. 816, yeah, yeah, that, that would actually be really, really good. You mobilize command. there. You're getting what I need, but not everything that I need. That's okay. Right here in Minas Tirith. Ooh, the Royal Barracks. I need that. That, that, that. I don't really need the Royal Hall, do I? No, I don't think I need it. Alright. Um. Yes. Interesting. That concerns me. A lot actually you're doing fine you're doing fine I'm about to have a solution to all of that I'm about to have sufficient reinforcements in the area you were going for Dol Amroth but you're fine now so you just hang out in the area and get more troops coming um, a royal barracks that gives me I think that gives me the uh, Talon Knights and then be able to get two of those so it allows more uh, replenishment of them so yeah definitely need to do that do that do that and do all of that because as they grow they they make more money uh, ooh, okay um, need to deal with these few rogue armies and then move these troops here to Mount Graham deal with Mount Graham and then we can deal with Latash 
All right, yeah. And then we can start our assault against Dunlin. All right. Um, I think we're at another intern. So let's intern. And, well, should I stop the recording here? Yeah, I probably should stop the recording here. All right, so until next time, this has been Warrior here. Hope you enjoyed the Let's Play in its entirety. And I will see you in the next one as we follow up with this. And follow up with the entire uh, offensives that I have going on. Until next time, have a good rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. Ciao for now.